Hi guys. Salt powered robot. I've done similar toys before, or projects I suppose we should call it. This one looks nice and simple and I think I'll put it together now. Yeah, should be fairly straightforward. That's a bag of active carbon, as they call it, in there. And we're supposed to put it in there, I think, to wet it. So that's not going to happen. Never mind, we should be able to put the rest of it together anyway. Okay, that's the stuff for the cell. Get rid of that for now. Right, identify the two ends of the chassis. One end has a space for the small motor. That's that. So this is the chassis. That's the space for the motor. There's the little gap for the gear. So there's only one place that can go. So that's there. Clip the other axle to the other end. Yep, yeah, I think we can work that out. Right. Carefully slot the motor in position. Make sure the gear on the motor interlocks with the gear on the axle. So we've done that. Push the pin on the pivot into the hole in the upright as shown. Okay. It's this piece. going there. Okay. I'm sure I'm making harder work of this than I need to. Clip the two arms onto the upright. Okay, clip the bottom of the upright into the centre of the chassis, yep, done that. Identify the battery holder and hold it with the open end, the end without the slots for the wire terminals closest to you. So that's this fella. that way around. Push the contact on the red wire into the right hand slot. Okay. Blue wire. It's actually got R and B written inside there. Okay. Done that. Push the battery holder onto the pivot of the upright. So that little circle bit goes on there. Yep, 
ಇಷ್ಟನ್ನು ಪುಷ್ ದ ಟೂ ಸ್ಕ್ರೂಸ್ ಟು ದ ಬ್ಯಾಟ್ರಿ ಹೋಲ್ಡರ್ ಟು ಬಿ ಐಸ್ ಆಫ್ ದ ರೋಬೋ you might need a screwdriver if you want to push them in any further the next bit is the salt water battery to make the battery place a magnesium sheet inside the battery cartridge so here's a battery cartridge i'm guessing these are the magnesium sheets uh with its tab facing through the hole that will be like that okay put a fabric sheet on top of the magnesium slide a copper sheet into the battery cartridge cover from the right as shown mm. from the right as shown that's with it that way up Okay, so that's in. Carefully cut open the bag of active carbon. Yeah, this is going to be messy. We need that bit as well. We want one spoonful of active carbon to go into the battery cartridge. Hmm. Okay. Let's see if we can do this this way. it down to make it fill the space I seem to have got it into a few other little bits and nooks and crannies as well flip that over to shut it and then flip the clips down Okay. So that should be our battery. Now it's ready. Let me get a clip to seal that. So now insert the battery into the battery compartment. Is that the right way up? Guess so. 
and some water. Add some salt, stir it. That's all dissolved, so we'll put some more in. Right, got some left on the bottom now, so we might have put enough in. Right, let's see if it works. Take a while for the water to soak in. That's better. Made contact now. Can you hear it? Off we go. Well, that works. I've taken the battery apart and washed it in clean water, so we should be able to use it again. Very little corrosion on the magnesium there. So, yeah, we should be all right to use that again.